Hello everyone, welcome back, Invisible Ink. Let's get started, straight into story mode. Where we left off, we just finished Singapore, and we're on to Brisbane in Australia. Uh, looks to be just about the same difficulty as our last mission, so let's just infiltrate and let's get this done. Bureaucracy is a beautiful thing. They're decommissioning this facility. There's a guard station here. You may be able to secure some untraceable weapons. The chopper is fueled and ready to go. Bring us back something nice, will you? All right. Apparently we're looking for some uh, untraceable weapons. Always my favorite thing to look for. Wouldn't it be awesome if we could get international like a an RPG? That'd be badass. All right. Um, <laughs> we know that's not going to happen. Uh, at the end of this round, we should really upgrade international's <laughs> movement speed, shouldn't we? Um, let's run over here. Okay. Nothing too serious there. We can run over to this doorway and kill two birds with one stone. Looks like that's off. And it looks like there's nothing in there. This area is deceptively, deceptively simple, isn't it? Uh, well, that was an easy first turn. Alright, uh, let's move international over here. Okay, this entire room is clear. There's our lift. And there's a camera, so let's just... Oh, we can't even hack it unless it's activated. Forgot about that. All right, let's let's mess around with you then, Mr. Deckard. And that's where guards spawn. Literally just an empty room. This is so. Is everything that we want in this direction? Because that's going to be a bottleneck. That's not going to be. A... That's not going to be good. We haven't encountered any guards yet, which is actually really surprising. Um, let's get international through this door. That was actually a risky move. I forgot to peek through the door before I went through there. If there was a guard on patrol, that would have been bad. Um, I guess we just end the turn. That's the only thing we really can do at this point. Um, let's move up here. Still... Really? I thought this place was supposed to be guarded. <laughs> I thought we were actually supposed to have some sort of difficulty to this mission. I mean, I might be speaking out of turn right now. So what cameras are turning on? Don't even know. Beautiful. Alright, so if we're going to want to go through that door, we're going to need a pass key. Uh, we did upgrade both Deckard and Inter International in order to get a... Oh, here, look at this. That was easy enough. And let's just console hack that. Um, looks like there's another door down here that we can barely see, though. Um, if you remember, we upgraded their Anarchy last time. Uh, which means that we can, we can steal from guards behind their backs. Uh, without knocking them out, which is going to make... Oh! It looks like we have a guard. Hello? Oh, he's not even in that room. And there's a console. He's not in there either, but that looks... <laughs> we just have a weight room. Beautiful. Um, I'm probably going to want international in here as well. Pack that. Can I not get any? Okay. This is just a really awkward angle. Let's rotate 90 degrees. Um. Okay. So it looks like our only option is to go through this door because if we go in here. Oh, there's a guard in there too. Oh, well, we can just hack that camera so we can see everything in here if we wanted to. And let's just pack the corporate safe because we're going to need to get in there anyway. Um. We could do a noise distraction if we wanted to. Um, 
I'm actually thinking about it because we can noise distract this guard and put him in this room. Wait, was there nothing? In, was there? Did I not get that guard? Oh wow, the ability's on cooldown now. And that guard's stationary. Wonderful. We'll figure out how to deal with that in uh in the next turn or so. Um, actually, can I steal from you? Huh? I totally just stole from him. All right then. Uh, let's get international over by this door. Have her take a look through. Doesn't look like there's anything, but there is there a guard right there? No, he went through the door. Okay. Moving on. No, no, no! Do not go through that door. Okay. What do you mean selected unit cannot move there? All right, so, <laughs> wow, we hit the jackpot on everything. Let's run over here real quick. Oh, I might have just made a mistake. Hopefully the guard doesn't go through there. I don't know where his... He's not even there. Okay. So he literally stops there. We're gonna have a pretty good time with this mission, I'm thinking. Okay. So we already looked through there. Let's take a pit stop over here. Get, grab some... Oh, well, we didn't even need any more power, it looks like. Neural Disruptor 2. Oh, it just has armor piercing. I don't I don't know what that does. I have no idea what that does. I'm not going to lie to you. We can sell stuff. Uh, I'm not going to upgrade his inventory. Chameleon movement. This effect triggers after the agent becomes cloaked. Oh, MP must be movement points. I didn't know what that was last episode, if you guys didn't know. Um, yeah, so we know what that is now. Let's just run through here. Just sit behind this guy. We should be fine for a little while. Um, just hang out there, International. You'll be fine. Uh, let's move on. Okay, firewalls increased. Do we have any new cameras on the line? Well, we're not going to learn anything about that. Well, let's just hack this. So now we know where all of the cameras are, and all of them are on two firewalls. I wish we'd gotten that a little bit earlier. Um, why? Why don't we move over here? Next turn we'll go over, we'll get the stuff out of the safe and leave. I think that'll be enough. Let's just unlock this door. I love that we can do that. And there's a guard there. Um, next turn, let's also have International move into that room. Actually, that's a horrible idea. I don't know why I said that. Uh, use cloak. No corporate intelligence. You see that? Ah, shit. I made a mistake. I done goofed. I done goofed. I done goofed. I done goofed. Just close that door. <laughs> Have them direct their movement towards that. I don't know... If, if he hasn't seen an enemy, if he will continue to track them. I'm just going to assume not. You 
a scary area. It wants me imagining things. Yep, okay. <laughs> Security meeting. Um... Wait, are you just gonna face that direction for the rest of the... <laughs> that was probably a horrible idea. Let's hope for the best. This might be bad. This room's safe. Let's just close that door. All right, so we're, are, is this just a self-contained room? It is. So I guess it's just one of those rooms where you could hide a body if you wanted to. Alright, so Deckard is the one who has the security card, so we're going to make our move next turn for that. Why is there... Oh my god. There's a security detail that just spawned that's looking for us. Advanced technology detected. Yay! Unlock this using your card, yeah. Okay. EMP pack 3. Detonates at the end of the turn when Prime disables all mainframe devices and drains charges from items in a range of 6 tiles. That's all that we are here for? Honestly seems like kind of a jip. Uh... You know what, let's just upgrade the inventory, what the hell. Uh, let's move incognito behind this table. Because that security detail is going to come in and make our day incredibly, incredibly difficult. I can't believe that's all that we were here for. I mean, there's still probably corporate intelligence on the floor, so that's what I'm hoping for now. Um, let's just, let's just break all of these. I mean, we don't need that one. We might need this one. Actually, we'll definitely need that one to get in there. So now we have two more rooms of visibility. It looks like there's a guard in there. Kind of, well... We can assume there was a garden there. We have very limited visibility at this point. It's kind of funny. Must have hacking skill level 4 to use. I can't believe that. We found advanced weaponry, we can't even use it. Not even International could use that if you wanted to. Alright, so... That was BS. I guess that's really the end of this mission. I mean, we could look for the corporate intelligence if we wanted to, but I don't want to take an unnecessary risk. Let's leave International there for the turn. Alright, so we have a straight shutout if we really wanted it. 
just, you know, down through here. If there was a door right there, that would be wonderful, but there's not a door right there, so we're not gonna... We're not gonna hope for something that can't happen, I suppose. I don't see anything in there. This guard's gonna come right through there. Alright. Let's hope for the best. Let's get out of here by... Uh oh So this is the security guard that we saw earlier. Um... Let's hope for the best. I knew it. Ah, uh, now we have that guy. No one heard. That's the first we can get this turn. We won't be able to be seen, I don't think. The elite force. Oh, right there. Beautiful. Right where we need to be. And he's, oh, he's looking right here. Okay. Duckard, you're gonna need to go... Let's rotate the camera so it's easier to see. You're gonna need to go right here. Actually, you're gonna need to go in here. And... Oh, this is gonna be a really hard decision. There is no good way to deal with this. That's probably the best way we can deal with this. I think someone's down. Okay, let's move out of this room. Uh, Deckard is going to be the easier one to get out of here, so we're going to have to get interna International out first, because Deckard can cover her. This guard's going to wake up the next turn. We'll be out of the room by then. Didn't we want to get out halfway through alarm level 4? Did I say that or did I just think that? I might have just thought that. Okay, we're basically in the clear at this point. Just as long as there's not a guard that's just gonna walk right through here. And we're out. That was pretty clean. We got 89% of the map, so it was basically just the upper part of the map that we missed. Alright, now for God's sake, let's upgrade your movement. Is that all we can do? Alright, so, looks like International can move. One more space. <laughs> Wonderful. 
Absolutely wonderful. Why is it that Deckard can... Oh, he can move 10... 11 sp... I have no idea. He moves 10 spaces, but he's only level 2. So just inherently, he's okay. Alright, that's fine. Alright. Thank you for watching. Uh, if you liked the video, feel free to like or comment. If you liked the content, uh, feel free to subscribe. I'll be posting stuff like this in the future. And have a wonderful day.